Hello everyone, this is William Armstrong, and I've got a replacement Xbox 360. It is a slim variant of the first generation 360s that are known to Red Ring. Um, this is the E variant, the Elite version. There's a slim and Elite, but this one is the one that has the fan at the top to the right of the unit. This one's that glossy plastic with the... Um, built-in 4 gig memory unit and I got it from somebody that I talked to and know that had over at least one to three systems and they allowed me to keep a system to have as I expressed that my Xbox 360 the one I had made a video on before red ring and died so I got another one and this one is the one with the touch buttons for eject and power the hard drive is mounted on the right side of the unit. When the console is standing up the other way, the hard drive will be at the bottom of the unit when it's standing up. And this also has the built-in Wi-Fi and HDMI. And the There's also another Xbox 360 version that has a HDMI but no Wi-Fi in it. And no Kinect connection on the back of it. This one's got the Kinect plug-in on the back. So I can use the Kinect sensor without having to use that silly AC adapter that you have to use with the Kinect for the older Xbox 360 models. But now I can use Kinect with this one. And there's onboard Wi-Fi built into this one now. So I can automatically use Wi-Fi or wired either one without having to use a network um, a wireless extender or something like that of the two. Or the Xbox 360 wireless adapter, which the... Original Xbox 360 models need a wireless adapter, but that one doesn't. So, this is William Armstrong signing out. Take care, and I will see you next time. Bye-bye.